Hello YouTube, welcome back. So, um, today what I'm going to be doing is going to, actually I'm going to be doing lots of videos of like reviews of like Sigma brushes and things like that, but I want to get my makeup out of the way, so I'm actually going to do a foundation routine, so before I get started into that, I wanted to um, show you guys what I'm wearing. So I'm just wearing an Eternity scarf. Um, the Corinthians 13 Bible verse of love. This is from Wet Seal. Some leggings and um, some combat boots. So, let's see. Can you see that? Okay. So, let's get started. And um, I'm going to be using MAC. MAC Pro Longwear Foundation. Um, in NC20 and I'm going to be using the beauty blender or actually I'm going to be using the Sigma dual fiber brush and F50 so a lot of people use this for different reasons but um I prefer I prefer it for this hold on let me move this okay Okay, let me just put more in my, the palm of my hand. So I just like to just do it in circular motion, but this MAC Pro Longwear Foundation, it does dry pretty fast, so um, I do have to hurry up with the, this before it um, it just dries up, and it's just horrible to wear after. Okay, some more. I, I waste pretty much a lot just because it dries a lot and I, I don't know, I just like a pretty heavy foundation. And sorry if you guys can't hear me, it's just I've been very sick. So... Sorry about the lighting too, it's just, it's going to get dark soon. Okay, so then I just bring it down. Okay, and then um, I set it with Bare Minerals, um, and this is 1C in Fair. And um, I'm using my large powder brush F30. Just get a little bit and just set it. So, um, with that said, I'm using the Sonia Kasha Concealer Palette for my under eye circles, and I'm just getting the lightest shade since that's the only one that's left. The other ones I've used all, and I like to use my hands with this so that it could kind of warm up and I just like to put it in the eyelid as well I've been really horribly sick so um I haven't really done videos or anything and I'm trying to hurry up because I don't want this to be extremely long so this is just going to be my face sound um, routine and then I'm going to make another video of like an eye makeup tutorial for my aunt. Her name is Rocio and she just really wants me to do a makeup look that I, she told me like three months ago and I haven't done it. And I also, I'm just going to cover up any like blemishes I have, which I'm getting a breakout here and then I have like this dark spot here of like so right there so I'm just gonna use it 
to do it there and then yeah okay so next I'm gonna be doing my eyebrows, eyebrows. I'm using the Urban Decay um, brown box um, brow box and it's in brown sugar so I'm just gonna open this and it does come with brushes I have them on the side but I just I like to use the uh, small angle brush by Sigma in E65 it's E65 so I'm just gonna grab I like to mix them because my eyebrows aren't that light but they're not that dark either so I just like to mix them and I just like to first start off tracing So I'm just going to use over here because I feel like I'm getting too personal over here. So I'm just going to start tracing it. And I tend to ha not have as much hair there. So that's what I hate. So that's what why I line that so that it looks like I have hair there. And you guys can see my nails. I did them yesterday. So that's all I'm doing. Just trying to fake like I have actual hair there because I don't. My eyebrows are very thin. Okay, so there you go. That's the first one. Next, I'm going to go with this one. Oh, sorry. And I'm going to do the same thing. Just... Some fell. Because I'm trying to hurry up. I don't want this to be extremely long. Okay. Okay. And so I'm just gonna get a spoolie and I'm gonna just wax, the, like put the wax on so it stays. And then I'll my be um, blush, I'm gonna be using the Naked Urban Decay Flushed palette, and it has the tr it has the trio, the trio, um, the blush, the highlighter, the con the contouring. So I'm gonna be using this blush. And I just tap it off. And I just like to put it on my cheekbone because I do want, since I am going to be making the contour, I it is very necessary for me to um, make sure the blush isn't rounded because then it's just going to take away the effect of the contouring. So I just... And this is a very pink blush, even as I tap it. So I... It's fine. I just like to um, just tap it on there so that I could have it, and then I like to blend it. And then I'm going to use the, um, and this is just a vegan brush. And then I'm going to use uh, the Flawless Face Brush from Bare Minerals, and I'm going to use that for the contouring. And go down. Okay. And next, I'm, I'm going to be using use the uh, Sigma Large Angled Contour Brush in F40. And I'll put these down below as well. And I'm going to be using that highlighter. And I'm just going to bring it down my nose, my cupid's bow, a little bit on my chin, and on top of that, and then on my cheekbone. Okay. And that's pretty much it. So I'm going to grab this, the contouring, and I'm just going to blend it with my pinkies, and I'm just going to put them all the way down to my nose. And this is going to create the effect of a thinner nose. Then I'm just going to blend it out with a, any regular brush. And I'm going to blend out this actually with my large powder F30. There you guys have it pretty much. Sorry, there's a lot of editing. It's just that I was really trying to get this under five minutes because I know my videos tend to be really long and I tend to talk a lot so right now I was instead of talking about the products I was just trying to hurry up and let you guys see the concept so um I'm gonna do another video showing a bronze uh 
bronzy make like eye eyeshadow tutorial. Um, it's gonna be neutral as well. So if you guys want to see that, then check out my next video video. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys soon.